What's up guys, welcome to another Call of Duty 4 free for all commentary, this time on Vacant. And as always, please do not forget to finger my video, whatever you feel deserves, as it does help my videos come faster and faster, and it takes a couple of seconds of your time. And as always, please do not forget to follow me on Twitter, to get the latest updates from me and the not so machinima team. So, in this commentary I wanted to talk about Call of Duty Black Ops, or just simply Black Ops, because I hate saying Call of Duty in front of it. And the, uh, the trailer, some things that I saw that I liked, some things that I didn't like. And how zombies have been confirmed by Best Buy. Apparently, uh, a website, a couple of websites have been stating that Best Buy has revealed that the hardened edition of Call of Duty Black Ops will feature four zombie maps that were made famous from World at War. So that does not mean that the four zombie maps are going to be coming from World at War. It's new four zombie maps. They're just saying that World at War made zombies completely famous and Activision has not uh, said anything about it neither has Treyarch um, but apparently Best Buy has saw the hardened edition and I guess they saw like a little sticker on the front because you know how um these games these days have like those stickers on the front that says oh this is uh, you like a, a voucher for map packs coming I guess they saw something that has something to do with zombies they knew everybody is fucking going crazy trying to figure out if zombies are in it or not so they have said something about it and I think that this is a, a positive thing for Activision and, and Treyarch because if they did not confirm it I don't think many people would pre-order and purchase Black Ops on the release date and these days a lot of companies they like to look forward to the release day so that way they could get as many uh, sales as possible and I think it's a good thing that it's already been confirmed because Treyarch and Activision they're really taking too long so Hopefully Best Buy is not bullshitting us. If they are bullshitting us, I'm going to go to my nearest Best Buy. I'm just going to go in there and start breaking shit. So, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But, um, so yeah, the, the trailer, the multiplayer trailer came out and it showed a couple of things that were pretty cool, a couple of things that weren't cool. And one of the things I actually liked was that you can have like a clan tag or something like that on your gun. And if you guys noticed that the gun had like these, um, this new type of camo, it's not just like paint on it it's kind of like you know like cloth you could put cloth around it how snipers do it I like that about the uh, the weapons also how you can um, customize your uh, your title and your emblem much more it's it looks like you can customize it much more than you can in Modern Warfare 2 uh, Semtex I like the fact that those are coming back because those are useful in games and game battles as well one thing I did not like is that little camera that can be used easily with campers another thing is the RC car I did not like it too much hopefully it's not too overpowered and hopefully they have a time limit on it because if there is no time limit on the RC car I don't know what the fuck Treyarch is thinking but if there is no time limit then I'm just gonna flip a bitch I'm gonna be writing a letter to Obama about that too so hopefully Treyarch won't fuck this up and you know Hopefully it won't just be a replica of Modern Warfare 2 because as God knows we do not want a replica of Modern Warfare 2. I mean they did that with uh, World at War because Call of Duty 4 it worked. Of course there was some flaws but it wasn't as bad as Modern Warfare 2. And uh, that's why they basically just copied it in World at War. And hopefully zombies will be returning. Hopefully Best Buy is not just bullshitting us. And because that, that's basically why I play World at War, Zombies. If not, I'll probably play it to try to record some gameplay. That only takes like one or two games. I got the gameplay for commentary. And the rest of the time, I just play with Zombies. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this commentary. Much more to come. As always, please do not forget to rate and check out the links in the description box. I will be linking you guys to the, uh, to the sources that I got my shit from. So, hopefully you guys can tell me if it's bullshit or not. Till next time, peace.